हे गाइस वेलकम टू फॉर ट्यूटोरियल्स सो गाइस टुडे आई क्रिएट वन मोर टाइम क्रिएट ब्यूटीफुल लैंडस्केप विद यूजिंग ऑक्टेन रेंडर सो फर्स्टली गाइस आई क्रिएट ग्राउंड सो यूज प्लेन दिस वन एंड आई इंक्रीज प्लेन हाइट गाइस ब्रैच साइज इज गॉट 400 एंड हाइट आई टेक 1000 सेंटीमीटर या एंड आई गो टू डिस्प्ले सेल आई गॉट शेडिंग लाइंस यस गाइस नाउ आई इंक्रीज ब्रेथ एंड हाइट सेगमेंट्स so increase like 80 and height segments increase this time i take 100 yeah right okay so guys now second tool i take displacer select this displacer and make chat with plane yeah guys select this displacer and i go to shading and use noise yes and click on noise guys global scale i take 2000 yes create smoothness and now I change noise type use this one yeah like Naki this one right and guys go to back and I go to object and I increase height height increase I take like 30 yeah right you can change seed also so go to shading and seed change yeah this one is also better right okay see guys that's my ground and now create water path so select this plate and right click select children and again right click connect object plus delete yes see guys that's my simple polygon shape and now create water path so use layout use sculpting this one yes i change layout path and use grab and guys go to down create simple water paths guys you can change also size i take like 50 right guys it is so easy and little bit more yeah done right see guys that's my water path and now again change layout use standard yes and guys second shape use landscape yes and select this landscape guys same size i take 400 and mid one i take like 10 and last one i take 1000 yes and go to down guys see that's my water right see that's my ground and second shape that's my water okay so guys all is good and guys now i create water selection so you can hide this landscape select this plane and select polygon and i go to select actually use live tool live selection and increase brush size like this yes and guys select water smaller and that's my water path select right see guys and more selection yes good yeah all is good see guys done so guys now i go to select and use invert selection tool yes and one more time go to select and use set vertex weight and value i take 100 percent yes see guys that's my vertex map see right okay so guys now all is good i apply some grass and flower so use this one plugin for aster and go to multi flower select and guys firstly i use flower so go to here library and go to down guys you can take any flower but i like simple this one yeah i like this one 
yes right okay so guys change size so select this here this is too much bigger and size change like this yes right okay see guys and now guys i go to octane and use live window check yes and drag and drop on here i apply on here yeah little bit smaller and up yes and click on here render preview yes right okay so guys now i change material type that's my physical render material and now change to octane so select all right select all material and i go to material and convert material check yes and again one more time material and remove unused material yes and see guys that's my octane material right see right okay so guys now select this image and again this time connect with here transmission yes better and again same connect with here guys you can change any color so i show you how to change color you can take color correction like this and connect with here yeah and select this color correction and you can change any hue saturation and gamma is dependent your color correction so close again third one connect with here and guys i change leaf texture you can change any texture select and guys i take white texture like this that's my pink texture i like this one yes yeah so close actually again connect with here right see guys and guys last one again change select and change material go to down i like this one this one yes and connect with transmission yes and close see guys that's my flower it's really beautiful okay so guys now i take grass so again i go to plugin and take here and i go to like guys go to grass and guys you can change any grass type so go to library yes and use any type of grass use like this one i like this one yeah and again change grass size grass size change i take more yes better right okay little bit guys increase it's too much i take 0.4 yes and one more time i use second grass yeah and this time use y grass like this and change size i take like 0.4 yes right okay so guys now you can change more setting on grass so select this grass and guys says guys size change like this and you can take patch radius like this and also change turbulence yeah this one turbulence like this yeah right and same on here and turbulence change and change guys height like this and grass size change yeah right okay so guys all is good now use octane scatter so i go to object and use octane scatter select all grasses select this one that's my grass and connect with scatter yes guys select this scatter and go to here plane drag and drop in surface yeah and distribution use surface yes right 
okay so guys go to back here and i change guys i change also count i take like 5000 yes but guys see that's my water path so select this vertex map connect with here vertex map yes and see right okay so guys i also change this size go on here yeah this one is also better and increase size yes right okay so guys all is good now i apply flower and guys you also change this grass material so you can create new material and you can apply any type of material so i go to image texture click select connect with diffuse and take grass texture i like this one and again select transmission yes and guys copy this material that's my grass material and change material texture guys you can download all texture from my website is free yes right okay so guys apply one by one like this one and this one yes right okay so guys now all is good i also apply flower so use again octane scatter this one select this flower and connect with here yes and select this scatter and guys plane drag and drop in surface and distribution use surface and guys vertex map same select this vertex map and connect with here yes right and count guys you can take count like 3000 yes and guys also change size so guys go on here this one and that's my vertex map and shader use noise and click yes and guys global scale i take like 2000 so go to back yeah okay so guys now i apply random effector tool so unfold this shader vertex map yes and select this scatter use random effector tool this one yes and select this octane scatter go to effector select this random drag and drop on here yes and guys select this random and i go to guys go to parameter and all take like five and guys five take minus five yes right and guys also change size scale size check and uniform check and scale size take minus 0 0.4 yes better guys also change like 0 0.3 yeah all is good so guys select this flower and again little bit change size like this yes guys you can change also size so go to here and go to size change like this make smaller yes better see guys it's really good right okay so guys now little bit back and use camera i take camera and camera check and guys select this camera and all rotation take zero and zero and y axis i take like 20 actually 20 yes and like and guys last one z axis i take 450 yes okay so guys now i apply tree so guys this time use tree go to again plugin and use this time forest tree and take any type of tree but guys i like this one yes and guys smaller size change and guys go to tree size i take like 0 0.2 yes go on here 
and guys camera on check go on here and apply on this ground yes right okay go to camera and guys copy this tree and go to here okay so guys now i also change texture so go to undo select this tree texture change to octane so select both texture and go to material and convert material check yeah and again go to material and remove unused material and double click on this material and double click on here yes see guys that's now fixed and i go to note editor yeah and now select and also connect guys bump map and close okay so this time again go to note editor guys that's my leaf texture connect on here transmission yes so close yeah right okay so guys my tree is finished now copy so press ctrl c and v go on here and go to down guys you can change only seed like tree seed like this one yes and copy go on here and you can change also tree size make smaller yes and copy yeah and change guys seed select also this one change seed yeah guys go to top view panel and go on here and again copy yes right guys i take like five time of tree and copy apply on this side yes and only change guys seed and position right okay so guys only rotation change i change rotation randomly like this yes right okay so guys tree seed change like this yeah better right and little bit closer this one also yes right okay so guys all is good now i apply wooden bridge so go to file and merge and see guys that's my bridge yes and select this bridge and make smaller okay so guys now change center axis and including children point center check yes and make smaller yeah guys that's really good little bit closer and down yes i show you see guys that's my bridge right and up okay so guys re-upload texture this one and guys change on material or octane so select this material convert to material and remove unused material and select guys apply wood texture see guys that's my wood texture yes and also apply on here yes right okay so guys all is good now apply on here yes and change uv i take like cubic yes see guys all is good texture is really good and now again i go to camera yeah okay so guys now i apply material on ground so create new material guys that's my ground material and apply texture see guys 
that's my ground material yeah this one select all and apply on note editor drag and drop yes and closer guys this one my roughness connect with roughness and this one my bump map actually that's my normal map Go on here. That's my diffuse color. Connect on here. Guys, that's my. It's my. Ambient occlusion. So use. You can take bump map. And last one. That's my. Displacement. And use displacement. Yes. And connect with input. And connect with displacement. Guys, select this displacement. And level of detail, I take 8K full and amount is good, 10. So close this material editor. Apply on plane. Yes. And select this plane. And guys, length U, I take 10 and 10. Yes. Right. And render preview. Guys, it's take a little bit time. yeah see guys that's really good it's really awesome and now guys i apply light and hdr image so stop this rendering and use guys i use this time octane daylight yeah and select this octane daylight and rotation guys rotate like this and more yeah right guys rotation like minus 60 on p that's my on top light and now also apply sdri light so use sdri use sdri environment and click guys i apply sky that's my sky texture and no go to back and guys go to uv and click Go to up guys lock this expect ratio and size i take 0 0.2 yes and guys again render preview yes see guys right it's really beautiful yeah great guys you can increase more grass effect so last one and now I create water material. So I go on create and shader. And guys, stop this rendering. Yeah. And guys, material type I use specular. Yes. And fake shadow check. Yes. And I go to guys index. Index I take. Guys, that's normal. It's my transparency. So increase like. 1.3325 yes and click on note editor yes so guys i use scattering medium connect with medium and use rgb and connect with here yeah and select and guys you can change density like 10 yes and use turbulence also select and connect with bump map so guys select this turbulence and octave this one i increase like guys i this time i take 7 and power 0 0.1 yes right okay so guys select go to projection yes and projection guys that's my texture projection and use box yes and select see guys that's my water material and close guys you can also download this material from my website so landscape uncheck and guys select this camera all guys y axis i take like 10 and z1 like 500 yes that's my camera angle so apply on that's my water and again render preview and click on here render 
yes see guys that's my water material right it's really good and now guys my background texture is missing so go to octane daylight and click on tag and mix sky texture check and render preview yeah guys now little bit change more as they are at uv click go to up guys little bit more change actually like 0 0.15 yes right okay so guys see that's my simple beautiful landscape and now stop this rendering i select this bridge little bit closer closer like this and go to down yeah right okay so guys again render preview yeah beautiful guys right okay so guys now all is good i go to render setting final render setting is my guys go to here and use this one pt and click on here setting and guys maximum sam i take like 2000 is good and gi clamp i take one yes right see guys that's it so close and render preview and after render it's really beautiful and see guys create full frame that's my final render it's looking really realistic and beautiful right okay so guys that's it my landscape is finished now if you like my video please share and subscribe my youtube channel thank you and guys you can download all texture and material from my website it's free thank you